What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, my name is Brandon. Uh, today's video is going to be different from all the other videos that I normally do. I just wanted to do a quick video on the filtration system for the Keurig machine. Okay. Uh, recently my Keurig did, it, it didn't have something that it needed. It, it didn't have the filtration system for the machine. I got it from work. Work gave it to me for free. It was just kind of sitting in the back of the shop, so I cleaned it up. And um, I didn't know that it was missing something, and that's why it wasn't properly, you know, making the cup of coffee. So um, I looked it up, and this is something that you need in your machine. So if you don't have one, you need to order one. They're real cheap. So um, also, um, you need the charcoal filtration pods, okay? Um, now in the directions, it says you need to do a few things before you could put it in there and actually have it start filtering your coffee. So this video is kind of just gonna go over those things just in case you have one and you need to know how to, you know, put in new pods or, you know, you, you just got one and it didn't come with instructions because it, it just depends on the person that you buy it from okay um, so the first thing in the instructions it says you need to soak the pod in some water okay so it's to soak it for five minutes so I'm gonna do that now and it says it's got to be completely emerged under the water it can't be floating on the top. It's got to be submerged into water like that. I've seen in other videos, they kind of, sometimes they float up and you got to keep on pushing it down. But mine actually stuck down. So we'll let that do its thing. Okay. So now that it's been five minutes, it says that you need to rinse the pod for 60 seconds under your faucet. So I'm gonna do that real quick. Now make sure you do that. I know mine wasn't a full 60 seconds, but make sure you do it for 60 seconds if you want the full effect of what you're doing here. Now it says um, to clean and rinse out your meshed thing. So it says, don't clean. It says to just rinse out the, the mesh, the mesh on the inside here. You wanna make sure you clean that out. So just rinse. Okay, so now you're going to put the thing together. I'm going to put the pot in like this. Actually, just kidding. We're going to put it in like this. And then we're going to slide the bottom on like that. Just like this. And then you got your whole situation all set. Now you're going to add that to that little circle right there. Okay, so you're gonna clip her on. Just like that. Should snap right in. Okay. And you're gonna fill it up with water. snap it back on to your Keurig machine. Put your lid back on. 
then it should look something like this. Alright guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.